Welcome Libras. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Happy to be here with you guys. So I didn't pull any energy before this read to see just to get a quick little peek on what you guys' energy is looking like and what's to come ahead. So let's take a look. If you are new to my channel, welcome guys. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Happy to have you here. Um, if you're a returning subscriber, go ahead and hit that like button. Go ahead and share this video with your family and your friends, all right? So let's see what energy we have coming towards my Libras. Libras for the remainder of July. The remainder of July. Oh, my gosh. Let's see. What message is there for July for my Libras? All right, we got one. I got destruction, okay? It's in the reverse. Some of you guys are surrendering. Okay, surrendering to a situation. Okay, some of y'all are trying to avoid uh, something negative or something, a disaster. Okay, you're trying to avoid a disaster. Thank you. All right, we got divine timing. I see this, we got regret in the reverse, okay? So you don't wanna regret something. You wanna make sure that it is done in the right time, or maybe you feel like it's not the right time to make a move, and you don't want to regret it later on, okay? You don't wanna regret it later on. Give me one more card, thank you. All right, we got admired. All right, we got admired. That came out upright. And I got karmic partner here. And I got that some of you are trying to purge, okay? See, look at this, deception, all right, and conclusion. Some of y'all feel stuck in a twin flame situation, or you feel like this person is a twin flame, and you're stuck in a situation, possibly that has a third-party situation, or somebody isn't telling the truth. Some of y'all feel like y'all need to purge this, or someone needs to let go of a karmic partner. You may feel like the timing isn't right, like it's not the right time for this to go down or for you to deal with this person. Um, and you're trying to avoid a disaster. That's exactly what I see. Like admired, you're possibly being admired. This person admires you. This person looks up to you. Um, you find this person very attractive. You know, like you guys may have secret admirers, okay? Why is that admired here? Why is that admired here? Or you guys got a crush on somebody. Why is that admired here? We got a fresh start. Oh, family. Oh. Okay. <laughs> so I'm getting that there's a fresh new beginning and something new happening. There could be an addition to the family. Why is fresh start here? Thank you. I got patience and nostalgia. Why is divine timing here? Tell me more about divine timing. Oh, we got bound. See, yes, yeah, see, something here about the signs. Pay attention to the signs, okay? Because it looks like it's something here is like the wrong time. It's not the right time, okay? Somebody has some, uh, why is bound here? Could be dealing with the Capricorn. Why is bound here stuck, yeah. Somebody has some, something that's keeping them bound. Okay, and that's possibly why the situation isn't like, it's not the right time because it's just like there's something that's holding you back or something that's keeping you feeling bound to this situation. Um, and something about here about divine timing. Okay, the timing has to be right. 
Maybe the timing has to be right for this fresh new start. Some of you guys are trying to start a new family or start something fresh. Okay, why is, I want to see what, the, you're trying to avoid a disaster here. Why is destruction here in reverse? Abandoned. I got abandoned here. And then we got mirroring. I'm getting lots of petty energy here. I mean, I'm just being honest, I'm getting like some petty energy. It's like you're trying to avoid being petty. But this is like stuck in your head. Like, I'm getting like tit for tat. Like, I'm getting like you're trying to avoid being petty. <laughs> you're trying to avoid being petty, or you're trying to avoid doing them how they did you. Um, so it's like the timing has to be right. You possibly got something up your sleeve here with bound and stuck. Like, I'm just getting like this, this real negative vibe like I really could be doing out here doing you dirty but I ain't gonna do I ain't gonna move like that and I'm getting like you feeling yourself or you got some admirers or you're admiring someone and you you're being patient you want to start fresh you want a new start on something Let's get the cards. Let's jump into the tarot because this is interesting. Let's see. All right. <laughs> I could really be out there doing you dirty. <laughs> I could really be out there doing you greasy. <laughs> okay. Libras. For the remainder of July, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. The remainder of July, we're going to talk about it. What messages is there for Libras for July 15th through the 31st? All right. I got the judgment card. I got the nine of pentacles. I got the Ace of Cups, the Queen of Wands. I oh, know that's the King of Wands, the Magician, and the Moon. Hmm. Three of Cups. Somebody wants a second chance. We got the Moon and the Sun card here. When things are coming to the light. Things are being revealed. Oh, and then you're watching somebody. You're watching somebody. <laughs> you're watching somebody. Page of Swords. All right, so let's talk about it. I feel like things are getting ready to come to the light. If there's something in the dark that you don't know about, it's getting ready to be revealed. I feel like somebody wants a second chance. I feel like you want a second chance on a situation. Because I got the judgment card. Or you're waking up to something. Like you're waking up to something. You're going through an awakening. You're realizing something. Okay. The judgment card is an awakening. Awakening. A wake up call. Okay. So you could be waking up to this. You know. That you want something new. Okay. You may realize that you've been single. Some of you have been single. You've been focused on your money. You've been doing well for yourself. Okay, but there could be a king of wands here. Leo C Leo Sagittarius Aries. Some of you are thinking about getting about a new guy, and some of you may want to rekindle, so y'all might have some options. Why is judgment card here? Eight of Wands. Alright, so there's messages coming in. Somebody might be calling you crying early in the morning. Checking you checking your phone early in the morning. Somebody's blowing up your phone. Why is the eight of wands here? Yeah, saying that they're gonna come to your house. They call you early. Why the five of swords? The five of swords is an issue. Somebody has some type of issue. 
Why is the Four of Wands here? Knight of Pentacles, Capricorns energy. I'm getting like a younger energy. And then I got you guys' energy here. Why is the Nine of Pentacles? Five of Swords. You may feel like, oh, you may feel like somebody's been stealing, been taking, took something from you, possibly stole some money from you, or stole an item from you, okay? Somebody might, you may feel like somebody is jealous of you. With that five of swords, you may feel like somebody's jealous and they came and stole something from you. And you possibly want to make them regret it, okay? Mm. They probably took something that was new. Why is the Ace of Cups here? The seven of wands. You got to stay in your ground. <laughs> you got to get in the business. It ain't nothing sweet. Ain't, it ain't sweet, okay? The devil card and the temperance. Could be a Sagittarius and Bob or Scorpio, but it, it ain't no peace. It ain't going to be no peace <laughs> until it's found. I feel like somebody came in and took something from you. Or you feel like somebody came and lied or stole or was being sneaky. King of wands, you make feel like it could be a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or I got Knight of Swords. So I'm getting lots of young energy here too as well. Um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, but very young, hasty like energy, okay? And you was, it was something that was new, okay? Some of y'all had something new and you may feel like somebody, this person is jealous and they tried to take it or mess with it or tamper with it. Why is the magician here? Queen of Pentacles. Mm-hmm. And see, you're very um you you got you're the magician, okay? You're the magician. You have manifested everything that you wanted. You've manifested, you know how to go get whatever it is that you want. And then you're very spoiled, like you spoil yourself here with the Queen of Pentacles. And you feel like all you had to do is act. With the Knight of Cups. All you had to do was ask. But since you want to do it like that, I'm going to make you regret lying to me and stealing from me. Okay? I feel like somebody stole something or is, has you feel like this person took something took something from you. Why is the Moon card here? Could be dealing with the Cancer or a Pisces, but you feel like they're keeping it. Look at this. The Devil. Mm-hmm. You feel like they're hiding something. Like this person is like the devil. Like sneaky, malicious. You feel like they, this person is malicious. Okay. Could be dealing with an Aquarius here. Okay. I got the hangman. And you might feel like they tried. You, you possibly waiting for them to uh, put it back. Waiting for them to go look for it. You probably confronted them like, no, you need to help me look for it. Why is the Three of Cups here? Okay, so it may pop back up. Okay, it may pop back up. I got the Three of Cups, the Ten of Cups, and the Hermit card. It could be dealing with the Virgo. But I'm getting like, there is like... Uh, coming back together So things possibly come back together But you could feel like this person is jealous of you They got an issue with you um, You might feel like this person Is being sneaky and malicious Wants to want to take from you Okay see yeah, I'm getting like the truth comes out It could be three people involved Okay Why is the hermit car here Like you might tell them now You need to help me look for it why is the Hermit card here? King of Cups and the Five of Wands. I'm getting like a nice, nasty energy. But this is this disaster, okay, that you possibly was trying to avoid. Uh-huh. Why is the World card here? Somebody might look in your closet like they might be looking helping you this is the story that i'm getting like it's just coming out this way i feel like like they might try to look in your closet like looking everywhere and saying that they don't see it but i feel like it pops back up why is the sun card here 
Mm-hmm. You you feel like they know where it's at. High priestess and the sun. You feel like, oh no, you know where it's at. Mm, things take a big dramatic twist. Mm-hmm. Things take a big dramatic twist. Why is the paper swords? Now you're keeping your eye on them. Like you watching their ass like a hawk. Yep. You watching what they spin. You watching to see what they do, what how they moving. Cause see, look, ask <laughs> somebody's asking for some money, or you watch. I'm telling you, like you watching them to see what they spin. You watching them to see. I feel like you feel like somebody took something from you, and you gonna make them regret it. Like you gonna regret it once again, lying to me and stealing from me. Somebody took something from you. You feel like they stole something from you. When well, they're reading with love. That reading went to the left. Soon as these cards went to flying out. Oh, that reading went to the left. Mine's the devil here. Mm -hmm. You might have felt like this person wanted to smoke. They took it so they can go smoke or they could go do something that's, you know, they got little habits. This person got little habits. You know what I'm saying? So you may feel like, and then I got the temperance here, yeah. So you know, you might feel like, okay, they want, they took it because they wanted to smoke. Why is the nine of cups here? Wanted to smoke or wanted to drink? Mm-hmm. Wow, this story had went to the left real quick. Like I'm thinking that this is this is a personal story. This was for somebody. And I'm not going to do it over and, and do another one because this message was specifically for, for someone. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. And if you want to book your very own personal reading, guys, that information is in the drop box below, okay? All right. Talk to y'all later.